trances Going all to different places, different planets Watch your aura pass me by, losing balance What if we run out of time and second chances? Empty-handed You like the fast life You like to drive and get down and dirty like a black guy You want some love, be like when you feel like calling a midnight mm, You got the best of me You got me losing sleep Hey curl friends, welcome back to another vlog. If you're new, I'm Carmenita. Welcome. Thanks so much for clicking on the video. Make sure you subscribe and also please turn on your notifications so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Hit that like button, you know, throughout this video if you like something about it. Girl, it has been a week, y'all. Today is Friday. Thank the Lord. And I'm just trying to figure out if God hates me or the devil just really don't want to leave me alone because at this point <laughs> I can't take nothing else I can't y'all so if you've been following me on both of my channels I did have a previous channel also but I deleted it if I don't know if I posted this situation on that channel or if I actually posted it on this channel but y'all remember me telling you about my car and how uh, my car was overheating and I had to pull over at some urgent care and I had to get, you know, my car fixed or whatnot because um, it was the water pump. The coolant was leaking in my car, which caused it to overheat. So I had to get a water pump, thermostat housing, distribution pipe, all that stuff done. Right. This was in July of 2020, y'all. Please tell me why my car was leaking coolant again, y'all. It's been like two weeks now. But it really, really got me on last Friday. I went to Chick-fil-A. Or was it Monday? No, I'm sorry. It was Monday, y'all. It was Monday. Went to Chick-fil-A and... Or was it Tuesday? It was Monday or Tuesday of this week. Went to Chick-fil-A and was on my way home. And y'all, the car started overheating. I had to pull over. I pulled over in some neighborhood and I had to sit there the car was smoking and I was just like why you know I turned on the air because it was raining and it was hot in the car and that's what did it that's what caused it to overheat so with that being said you guys there was this man that just stopped and was like you know you okay you need some help finally after a few cars passed by us people didn't start really stopping until they saw winter sitting on the side of the sidewalk but anyway um so this man stopped and he asked me if i needed help and i was like yes you know my car is leaking coolant and it's not holding the antifreeze that i do have in my trunk so he helped me out so much you guys he sat there with me the whole time let my car cool off he went back home and got a whole thing of antifreeze and he also um, brought me some water bottles as well a big huge jugs of water actually and so he poured all this water in inside of my um the thing where the antifreeze goes i guess radiator i don't know but he poured that in there and i made it home but y'all as soon as i pulled in my driveway it just leaked right on out and i was just like oh my gosh so basically um thursday no, Wednesday, I decided to take my car to the mechanic Wednesday morning, y'all. I, I just thought I was going to make it right. I had waited and waited and waited until I thought maybe the car would hold, you know, the antifreeze. Girl, no. 6.45 in the morning, my car overheat and I had to pull over at some kind of police station <laughs> or police place where they work on the police cars. Girl, it was so dark and I was so mad, y'all. I just... I couldn't even cry. All I could do was just shake my head. I was like, dang, man, I'm literally down the street from the shop, the mechanic shop, and I can't even bring my car there. So anyway, after a while, the mechanic people actually got a tow truck and came and got my car and they picked me up and brought me back home, you guys. So my car has literally been in the shop for two days and we're going to get it today. I'm going to get it back today. Thank the Lord. I just want to say I did not lose faith at one point I, I was about to because I was like you know what guy I don't know I, I don't even know like at this point it's giving 
it's giving not real, you know? <laughs> Cause I'm like, why does stuff keep happening to me? So y'all thank the Lord. I just stayed prayed up. I had to take, went to, to the bus stop. The bus does not stop in front of our house. I had to take her to the bus stop in the complete darkness. Okay. Scared out of my mind. She won't even scared. She was, but she wasn't, you know, I'm glad that I instilled that fearlessness in her. But at the same time, I, I was like, okay, now this is a moment where you really need to be scared, <laughs> but she wasn't y'all. We made it. We were safe. You know, I'm in a safe neighborhood, but still, you know, it's dark. You don't know what's out there. So, um, yeah, we, I just, look it's been a week y'all just stay prayed up in any situation that you're in because <sighs> faith over fear because <laughs> that's all i had for the past two days was just faith y'all so anyway i'm going to eat my lunch and we're going out to eat today i ain't cooking nothing don't feel like it don't i don't want fast food we're gonna go eat at golden corral today so i told winter when I get my car, we're going to head over there and then we'll hit the grocery store later. Of course, I do have to get some groceries, but I just wanted to tell y'all what's next. Okay. Like, can I catch a break? <laughs> can I catch a break, sis? I'll be back. I can tell you my problems, meditating my silence. But I keep pushing my pen, rotating my stylus. Brokenness feeling like sin, not no Creflo dollar. Used to be left on red, now all the girls go holler Now all the girls go follow, all the fake friends gon' pile up I need peace to borrow, get that shit right back tomorrow Somehow all the fans go bravo, smile so much to hide my sorrow Say this shaky in Verado. I can't hold the frown too long I can't stay down too long Look, run from pain, run from strain, run from things Run from schemes Couple things I show, couple things I don't I can tell you my problems, I can tell you my sins I can tell you my problems, I'm uncomfortable in my skin I'm uncomfortable with my ends, I'm uncomfortable with my friends I'm a <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Winter <laughs> She clapped and did it start it <laughs> Hey y'all, we're back in the car, I got my car back, OMG so happy to have my car back but food was delicious winter loved it can i go out this way uh, yeah let's go this way yes food was good you know it's it's golden corral so it's not like you know it was bomb but it was good we're full it was bomb winter thinks it was bomb so that's all that matters y'all so we're about to go to walmart now and get some groceries I did want to go to Harris Teeter, but I don't want to go through traffic. It is just too much traffic out here. Everybody getting off work and just all over the place. So I'm going to just get a few things in Walmart that I need. And then uh, I'll get the rest either tomorrow or Sunday. Can you get on your side of the road? Hello. So anyway, my car rides good. Sounds good. <coughs> I'm trying to figure out why they put a serpentine belt on though. I don't know if that was needed or not. I'm going to ask them. They're closed right now, but I'm going to ask them. What was the point in putting a serpentine belt? Because you ain't say nothing about that. Y'all know. I always check under your hood when you get your car fixed and make sure, you know, something was done and nothing looks the same. So I'm going to check it when I get home and make sure everything's good. But I just thank God that I got my car back, girl. And so, I took two cookies. Ah, she took two cookies from Golden Corral. So I'll talk to you guys when we get in Walmart. Well, that's good. We don't want it to be squeaky. Mm -hmm. Come on, you gotta hurry up, girl. What you doing? Oh my God. You blocking traffic, girl.
y'all made it back home finally walmart had no bacon no lunchables no i mean it was weird there was a whole section where it was empty totally empty and it had a sign that said we're improving how you walmart so i don't know but they just doing that at the wrong time of the day take all that stuff out baby so anyway where's the great popsicle oh okay. mm -hmm. Probably do a little grocery haul for y'all and then I'm gonna call it a night because I'm tired I'm ready to take a shower go to sleep <laughs> drink some tea and then go to sleep and winter's leaving tomorrow to go to her dad's I'm gonna clean this coffee maker out it says to clean it with white household vinegar y'all just like you would make a regular pot of coffee and I have to do that like six to eight times just kind of pouring it out rinsing it pouring it out and rinsing it so i'm about to do that now because i have not had coffee in like two days girl all right y'all we have some cheese balls of course that's for winter snack got some ground turkey if you have not tried this cereal please make sure you try that and focus cheerios oats and honey it is the best winter got her fruit snacks y'all know that stays in the house got some applesauce she has some gogurt frosted flakes she wanted those i got some coffee and got my outshine bars winter likes the grape i like the peach i don't see my peach did you get oh i see him um i got my white chocolate mocha creamer and also the pumpkin spice latte and y'all this was like a dollar and 29 cents but this one was five dollars i'm trying to figure out why is it because it's the pumpkin spice like what's what's up with that why they both couldn't be a dollar and some change i was very upset about that anyway i got some gum some cheese and i got some v8 juice the healthy greens because i am going to be making a smoothie in just a little bit winter got her some gum i got some bread we gotta keep bread they didn't have um like I said, any turkey, ham slices, none of that, y'all. They was just out of all of that. It was weird. I got some orange juice because I am vitamin D deficient right now, so I got to get it together. Um, I got some spinach. I'm going to put some spinach for breakfast um, with some egg whites. I got sweet potato fries. They didn't have the kind that I like, which is the rosemary. So, um, yeah, I got to find that at Food Line, I guess. I got the mixed fruit, the pineapple, strawberries, peaches, and mango, so I can make the smoothie. Blueberries as well. Got the apple juice for winter when she takes to school. Here's my peach outshine bars. Got some Activia yogurt. I kind of like this yogurt. It's not bad at all. I got some tuna helper. I'm going to be making that as well, probably tomorrow. Winter got some pickles and caesar salad for winter she loves those and some toasted strudels in winter like sunny d i like the uh homemaker <laughs> um orange juice so yeah that is the grocery haul you guys that's everything so yeah so i just cleaned this so now i'm going to i guess do it again rinse it out with water like six to eight times so i'm hoping that's what the instruction said so yeah let me put these groceries up and talk to y'all in the next video please make sure you hit that like button don't forget to subscribe and leave me a comment down below and i'll talk to you in my next one i can't hold frown too long i can't stay down too long Look, running from pain running from strain running from things running from I can't hold the frown too long I can't stay down too long Look, running from pain, running from strain Running from things, running from skin